I decided I needed to make a video tonight because I've been getting a lot of emails tonight. I come home tonight, go check my email, and in my PMs, there is no fewer than nine different messages saying basically the same thing, which is, oh, the Senate is passing gun control. The Senate is passing gun control. The Senate's on the verge of passing gun control. All the Republicans have flipped, and they're, they're passing it in the dead of night. They're passing it without making any reports. They're passing it secretively, blah, blah, blah. And I couldn't figure out where all this information was coming from. I'm asking people, I'm not finding anything to back this up. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, eventually, it led me back to a couple other videos from uh, by other YouTube channels that were made very quickly. And I think in their haste to get some videos posted, they posted some information that people misread. Uh, people didn't read the articles that they actually, to their credit, they did link the articles they were talking about. People didn't bother to read the article. They just misinterpreted what the people said and ran with it. I just want to calm everyone down a little bit and say, no, the Senate is not passing an assault weapons ban tonight. Uh, it, it isn't happening. The assault weapons ban is pretty much dead. Uh, what people are talking about is there have been a lot of Republicans that have stated that they will flip over and vote yes on a bill that expands background checks. And even that is not the universal background checks thing as it stands right now. Uh, the universal background checks that stand right now today, they even admitted that that is probably not going to get the 60 votes it needs. Uh, they know that in the, exist the way it exists right now, it's not going to pass either. And I have told you from the beginning that uh, assault weapons ban wouldn't pass. Background checks may pass. Uh, high capacity magazines were probably more likely. A ban on those was probably more likely to pass uh, on a federal level. On state levels, pretty much the same thing, but same thing on a state level <clears throat> or on a federal level, I mean. So what they're saying is that the bill as it's written right now, the, the universal background check bill, will not pass. Uh, but what they're saying is that they hope what they'll do is they'll come together, both sides, Republicans and Democrats, and put together a expansion of our current background system that will pass. And what you're seeing is all these Republicans that are going around to each other saying, okay, here's our chance to write it the way we want to write it, put things in it we want to put in it, time to negotiate the bill. Uh, that's not saying the bill is going to pass, but it's got, you know, you're getting some Republicans that are saying, we will vote yes if this is in it. Uh, some of those things that are in it, you know, strengthening the mental health care system, uh, some things that are even kind of off topic that are in it, but not off topic, but a little more out there on in it are giving veterans an appeals process if they get voted as incompetent to own a gun. Another thing that they want in it is a actual law that prevents any type of registration or keeping of documents and prevents any uh, uh, regulations that would require private sellers to keep any documents of sales or any records of sales. So everyone can stop panicking. They're not passing the assault weapons ban. The assault weapons ban, like we have said in previous videos, is pretty much dead. Now, we said you do still have to be alert, though, because there's other things still coming. There's still uh, magazine bans, universal background checks, things like that. There's, there's, there's going to be other stuff that comes up, too, especially on your state level. Pay attention to your state level. But I just want to let everyone know they are not passing the assault weapons ban in the middle of the night tonight. All they are doing is there are some Republicans that are kind of not rolling over, but shifting their position a little bit, saying that they will support the bill if it's written a certain way and it includes certain things. Not the way it's written now, but if it includes certain bills and includes certain things. Now, I want to go ahead and get this uh, video with over quickly. Uh, I have a lot of other things I want to talk about, like why I don't support universal background checks and the, met and the uh, efforts that are going into the background checks. But I rushed out here to do this really quickly, just like the other people made their videos. And I want to get, well, actually, uh, I even carried my, sh I carried my shoes out here to put on so that I wouldn't be standing on the cold concrete floor, but I didn't put them on. So now I'm standing on the cold concrete floor barefoot, freezing to death. So I'm going to cut this video short and uh, just keep your eyes open. I've got some more videos coming up on this topic, but uh, they will come later and I will film them later after I put my shoes on.